Fabian, a, a tough afternoon against a very good Shrewsbury side. What's your reaction? Well, it was a difficult draw. Before the game, we knew it. They are in, in good form. And um, I feel like we miss a bit of confidence at the moment in the last couple of weeks. So I think we started well the game. But those two early goal, just like within two or three minutes, I think just killed even more our confidence. And even if, if the, the, goal, the game play for me was good, I feel like we don't believe enough in ourselves. And um, it's really disappointing, yeah. It was always going to be a difficult game. Shrewsbury have done pretty oh. similar to teams in League One this season. So it's no, not necessarily a disgrace on, on all shot down to lose, but you feel that there is a, a, a confidence factor at the moment amongst the squad. Yeah, I, I feel, I think we, sh we need to show like a different face next week um, for the fans because they've been they've been good. There've been like a lot of fans they came today, and they deserve more than the performance we gave to them. But yeah, they're really good in in transition. They know what they're doing exactly. They're really on point with their their tactics, and. Yeah, it's not a good result for it, obviously, but we need to show some character next week because the main thing is the National League and we should be focused on that because this is a good squad and uh, we have all of chances to get promoted this season if we do things right, it only if we do things right. So that's the important thing for you, how the team responds next week against AFC Fylde to a couple of disappointing results. Yeah, exactly. I mean, it's not the first defeat and that's not going to be unfortunately the last one of the season, but we need to bounce back and in a good way to put like a good performance next week to get back on track in the, in the league because it's really tight in the table with just six points to the top of the league. So everything is possible. So we're not going to give up and we still can achieve that this season. Mm -hmm. How do you feel you did yourself out there this afternoon? A couple of the Shrewsbury media have said that you played particularly well. Were you happy with your individual performance? Well, I've been injured the last couple of days, week. I mean, when I came here at Aldershot, I wasn't fit at all. So I'm grateful with the work the staff and the physios done with me. They've been really good with me. So I'm not part that particularly like happy with my performances because when you lose five nil you can't say like I've done really well. You can't say that because like as a team it was just not good enough so I'm not gonna say I'm happy. But uh, do you feel like we we're close to seeing the best of Fabian Robert? Yeah I think so. Yeah. Uh, like like I said to to James the assistant, I said after the first a month and a half. I said that was like my pre-season and I think Toronto was my first like game of the season when I was feeling ready and fit. So I think now I'm ready to give more and more and more. And earlier this week you extended your stay with the club on loan. You, you happy to, to extend your stay and to be, to be getting games? Yeah, I mean the way the team want to play it's a position like position team, we are expensive, we don't just shell the ball. It's a proper game plan every week and I appreciate that because for me that's how you should play football. I know I'm foreign, I'm French, that's how we play in France. And so yeah, I'm enjoying my time here. And you said it's important to bounce back. Do you think, you've, you think the team aren't that far away from, from victories, from a, a really impressive, convincing victory? I mean, this team done well last season start really well and it's just like sometimes when the adversity is like a bit too hard it's kind of like we give up so I think we need to just like change that it's just mentally because the quality is there let's be honest the quality is there so just the mentally thing that we need to change and uh, if we do that we do things right that's going to be a good season for, for Undershot and so so thank you very much for thanks